Hi right, guys, welcome back to Columbia Auto Service. We got a 2019 Chevrolet Blazer with 23,000 miles on it. The customer came in and asked me if we'd done alignments. I said, no man, we don't have alignments. She said, well, when it gets to about 55, it starts shaking. I said, we may have a tire about it. She said, well, it started doing it after I got stuck in the mud the other day. So I said, okay, well, you may have a bunch of mud inside your rim. She said, well, I went through the car wash and washed the, done an undercarriage wash, but it's still doing it. I said, okay, we'll get in, we'll get on a rack, see what's going on with it. But I've already looked inside one of these rims, it looks like it's just caked up with mud in there. And that mud will get in there and act like a wheel weight and cause your tires to be out of balance. So we're gonna get her jacked up in there, check the inside these rims out, get a water hose out, see if we can wash all this mud out and get her back riding smooth as a Chevrolet or ride. <laughs> Oh yeah, look at that mud caked up in there. <laughs> That'll cause a wheel to be out of balance right there. It sure will, so it goes from here to here. That's a pretty good bit of weight on that wheel. It'll cause a vibration. I don't know why she was mud riding. Mm, driver front, nothing. Okay, so that ain't gonna be too bad. She just got got in one wheel. And that's the only place I see any type of mud, so she must have just got this side stuck. I think I'll still get the water hose and wash it out a little bit.
All right, we got her clean as a whistle now. But she had to have got this side stuck. There's grass and mud all down through here on this side. All right, let's see if we can get this Chevrolet up to 55 MPH. Make sure our vibration's going away. Which I didn't come drive it beforehand, I probably should have, but I saw all the mud caked up in there and I'm pretty sure what it was, what it was what the problem was. smooth as a Chevrolet ought to be. No vibration in the steering wheel. I don't feel any vibration in the seat. I think we have took care of her problem. She was getting a little mud on her tires and caused a vibration. That's what happens when you get a little mud on your tires. But anyway, that's going to be all this video, a little short video. Just stay out of the mud, and if you get in the mud, you got to rinse it out of your rims or you'll have a vibration. And that'd be all from Columbia Auto Service. Don't forget to drop down in the bottom section and leave me a like and drop me a comment. I appreciate you. Have a blessed day.